Well, just gonna take you on a little tour. Hopefully this ain't too bouncy. There's what's left of my garden. It's not producing much anymore. Kind of let it go to hell. Still getting some peppers. Next year, I think I'm gonna do a, try to do a greenhouse because, man, the grasshoppers are just getting me. That's some of them are, with the cooler weather, they might spring back. All right, let's go down the trail. And this used to all be overgrown. I mean, you could not see them mountains back there. It was all, the whole back property was overgrown. And it took me a long time to get all this clear. And this property's full of rocks. And so I just kind of lined the trails with them. And most of them didn't even have to pick up. You just kicked them over. But I think, uh, you know, in the future, this little area here would be real nice. Put a picnic table in, maybe some benches. Neighbor's got a goat over there. It's been crying all day. I don't, I don't know what it's doing. To me. But it's driving uh, rooster nuts. And these trees, well, when I cut these trees down, this was really overgrown. Uh, so I left them tall so I could find them. So I need to come back through here with the chainsaw and cut them down to the ground. Uh, but man, this was all dirt. And now, you know, it's got growth on the, on the ground. It's really looking nicer. Coming into the fire pit area. I haven't burned a fire all summer. And it's too dry now to do it. With all my junk. I got a great big fire pit. Little old bench. And I have another trail that goes way down there, loops back around. I did not weed eat that. Let's see if we can go in there a little ways and fight these spider webs. Uh, yeah, it goes way down in there. But, uh, I'm in shorts, I'm not going to walk through there. And this is my deck. It needs painted again. I used old reclaimed lumber <laughs> that wasn't any good. And the steps caved in. It's getting pretty ugly looking. Yeah. Had an old toilet seat. Put a bucket down there for a trash can. There you go. Alright, sorry for all the barking. Now people around here got about a dozen dogs apiece. They don't spay and neuter them. So there's like new puppies every several months. And they just run around loose and it drives me nuts. And I weed eated all this in July, about the end of July. I'll do it again in October. Then it'll be nice and low for the, uh, the winter. Right, let's keep it going. Hasn't grown much since July. And there's another fire pit right there. That one I mainly use to burn up timber. Got some logs I cut up over there. a lot of work for one man to uh, keep up a place. Maybe not if I was 25, but it is now. And that's where I'd like to build a little, little 10 by 12 cabin. Have a nice view. It's really good in the winter. Put a little wraparound porch on it. Right, this trail goes along the east end of the property. And I did not weed eat this down in July, so I'm going to have, have my work cut out for me in October. I may get on it sooner if the weather gets cooler. 
but man, that's so many rocks in there. It, it'll never be able to be mowed unless I had a bulldozer. But it does look nice when it's cut down. There's Clippy's little little gnome house. And this is a really old, huge oak tree. Darn rabbits. There we are. There's Libby's kennel. She goes in at night or when I go somewhere. Well, here lately, I've just been leaving her out. She she likes being out there. Just realized I hadn't ate all day, so I made me a fried tater, scrambled egg skillet with melted cheese. You guys are like, man, he puts cheese on everything. That's right, I like cheese. But I'm gonna squirt some ketchup all over that. Wash it down with ice cold milk right out of the daggum jug because nobody else lives here, nobody cares, and why dirty up a perfectly good glass? Mmm, fried taters, cheese, eggs, and yes, still using up the green peppers. Good night.